is going on guys? So welcome back to another EMC vlog. I know I've been kind of slacking on the thrift videos lately, but don't worry, we're getting back into the swing of things. I had to deal with a lot of personal issues. Today, I have a huge pile right here. I'm gonna be showing you a trip to the thrift hall, but I did not thrift these locally. I thrifted these online, so whether it's eBay, whether it's an e-commerce website, whether it's Instagram, I've just been thrifting online. I didn't have time to go actual thrifting and make tripping and thrift episodes, so while I was dealing with the personal things, I was just on eBay and all on all the websites. You definitely got some heat. I'm kind of trying to see how things are because, you know, I go to these trips to the thrifts and I get these Marlin shirts and I get these polo shirts and then like, I think about it and anybody can find these stuff. So I need to start finding stuff that not everybody has. Otherwise, I'm probably going to run out of business and all this stuff is just going to be sitting here because everyone has decided to thrift for themselves or they're finding it somewhere else. So to get into it, this is already sold, which I'm not salty that I sold it because I ended up selling, like I made the choice to sell it. Originally bought this for personal use. Somebody saw it, they're like, what do you value it at? I told him what I value it at. He came with $10 under and I was like, you know what? I'll sell it to you, bro. Like, I'll definitely help you out. So it's a vintage Malcolm X snapback. Tag and all. So this is already sold, so if you're watching this, shout out to you. It's shipping out today. Next, we have a size XL vintage DMX shirt. It says X gonna give it to you on the back and on the front. And this is vintage made in USA. I saw one of these going on eBay for like 280 or 250, so that was crazy for the find that. Size large, we have the Marty McFly shirt. I'll let you guys know what's going to be for personal so far these two items will be on my website link down below Tommy people we have a vintage Tommy Hilfiger jacket in a size large on the left sleeve you have the Tommy patch on the back we have Tommy Hilfiger embroidered on the hood a yellow hood Tommy Hilfiger Again, size large, but make sure you guys check out link down below. It could fit like a medium, it could fit like an XL. This is for personal. Got the Tommy, vintage Tommy, he'll figure sailing gear. With the hood all the way up, the stripes on the inside. Tommy, he'll figure sailing on the top of the hood. And then on the back, we have Tommy, he'll figure sailing. Unfortunately, there is some bleeding up top. I don't know if you guys can see that with the red, but... I can never find this, like this is a really rare piece, so I figured it'd be nice for the personal. Another item for the personal, we have this Guess Elongated Raincoat. See Guess and Navy, and on the back, we have Guess USA. I was originally gonna sell this, but I tried it on and it's just too fire, so I'm adding it to my personal collection, 100%. 2007, we have Vintage Metallica, size medium. 1988 legit vintage we have poison you know this is the stuff that I wouldn't find at local thrift stores so I felt like you know what let's try it out let's see how it is obviously I didn't pay two dollars for these items so they are gonna be a little bit more expensive but it's legit vintage like the Tommy jacket it's such hard to find like these actual 88 poison shirt a 2007 Metallica shirt and then I'm about to show you another vintage Metallica shirt it's really hard to find so this is a 1994 Metallica shirt. Again, these are all mediums, the, the two Metallica and the Poison, and they are vintage. Another vintage, but size XL, we have the ACDC. And then on the back, it has 1996 World Tour. The vintage Made in USA tag. Size 34, we have vintage Tommy Hilfiger jean shorts. On the left side, we have the Tommy Hilfiger, like, hammer. Then on the back, have Tommy jeans. It doesn't have the vintage Tommy tag, but it does have it on the inside. I'm not sure if they just decide to switch it up and use this tag instead. So size 34. Size XL, vintage House of Blues. The back. We got another Tommy jacket, the same style, but this one is a forest green. Again, Tommy patch on the left, the embroidery, and this is a yellow hood as well. This size is a 2XL, but I would say it fits an XL. 
It's like a medium. We have this Babe collaboration with Cause. This is an older one too. Probably from 07, I would believe. Maybe 06. Size XL, we have the Hard Rock Paris. I love these colors. And it is legit Hard Rock merch. We have this tie-dye Harley Davidson in like the blue. It's the Hawaii, you have the Pacific. Size XL. It, so many electronic artists, it should be criminal with literally all the DJs. Then on the back, we have some clubs. No size tag, but I'd say fits like a large. We have this vintage New York Jets. Tina Turner. This is from her 2000 tour. So it's not 90s, but it's still vintage. About 17 years old. Size XL, by the way. Size large. I was going to keep this, but we'll see. We have the vintage Jordan Elmo. And this actually is legit Sesame Street merch. On the back, we have Elmo in the Fila symbol. This thing is just so fire. I know they made another one of this, the Elmo, but it's like Polo Sport. And I'm trying to find that one for the personal, but... Size XL, we have Vintage Mickey Ink with the huge patch all embroidered. Size Large, we have this Polo Ralph Lauren Spain. Literally patches all over. We got number eight on the side, the Spain flag on the left. Number eight on the back. Size XL, but could fit like a large. We have this vintage Fila jacket. Stripes going all the way around. Now getting into my personal cops. I have this vintage Beatles, the yellow submarine. With all the Beatles down there, yellow submarine. Since I do live in Florida and it is extremely hot, I am gonna need some fire tank tops. So we have the vintage, then on the back. I think I've said it in my video before, but I'm really gonna try to collect as much Obama shirts that I can in my size, just cause I feel like they're fire and I feel like eventually they're gonna be worth something. Not to say that I'm gonna sell it, but once the hype is there, I'm gonna have like the most fire Obama shirts. That's the reason why, like I don't care about making money, but like once the hype is, I'm gonna have like the insane Obama shirts that everyone slept on. So to start it off, we have, this is just a front design, but the design is crazy. It says, change we can believe in, Barack Obama 2008. Got a double-sided one, change we can believe in. And then on the front, we have, yes we can, Obama. Four more years on the back. And on the front, we have having moving forward with Obama. So if you guys are thrifting and you ever see double-sided, yo, I swear, every time I make a vlog, somebody calls me. Oh, I'll call him back. So if you guys see any double-sided Obama shirts in a large or XL, send me a DM of it and I will most likely cop it unless I already have it. Uh, so just let me know. I think I'm going to keep this, but this is a vintage 1992 Polo Ralph Lauren towel. So you see the RL92, the actual Polo Ralph Lauren. And I've never found one and I've always want one just because I live in Florida, you know, we go to the beach and... I need some heat when I go out there. So I think I'm gonna end up keeping this. I don't even think it'll fit, but it has Polo Ralph Lauren spelled out on the side. It has the American flag RL92. And then on the bottom, it has America Cup 1992. And then for the grail of the grail, which I think I showed you guys at the end of the video, but not many people stayed all the way to the end to see it. But we have this reversible vintage Tommy Hilfiger color blocking. So on the front we have the navy red and white. You flip it over, we have Tommy all embroidered, stitched in. The Tommy flag and then we have Hilfiger at the bottom. And what's super fire, like I've seen these jackets multiple times, but I didn't know that they made a reversible one. So I can easily flip this inside out, it will be Sorry, I'm trying to do it as I'm talking. It'll be a solid red jacket, but then on the sleeve, it'll have the Tommy patch, like the blue and green one that I'm selling. 
So on the left sleeve it has a Tommy patch. If you just want to like, if you if you don't want to stunt too hard and you want a low key flex, then you flip it inside out. But I'm probably never gonna wear it on that side. I'm probably gonna always hardcore flex with this. And this is a grail of mine. This is a kid that DM'd me. He was actually a subscriber. He DM'd me, he's like, yo, I went thrifting, I found this jacket. And I was like, yo, I 100% want that. Like, I'm never selling this, so thank you very much. He actually gave me a very good price on it too. Like, whenever people find these, they always price them at two to $300, which I told myself I'm never gonna spend $300 on this jacket. So he hooked me up, and I'll be 100% honest with you, he wanted 80 bucks, so I paid 85. So I helped him out with the shipping. So I got this for $85 shipped. It's a size XL, but it's gonna fit me. It's gonna stay in the purse collection. Unless I find a size large and maybe I'll size swap with them. But my Tommy collection is too far. We got this one. We got the South Beach one, which you guys already know, you guys love. We got the signed Tommy, the puffer with the Tommy going down there. I decided I guess I'm gonna keep this one just because I don't want to deal with the eBay shit and whatever it's still fire so Tommy and we got some more but that's it for like the big jackets probably do another video that I show like my whole Tommy personal collection because you guys are gonna see some things that I've never showed before so unfortunately that's all we have for today's haul I think today's haul was actually really decent again I'm gonna try something different you know maybe try to find the top pieces and help you guys out with because I have to try to be different. I have to separate myself from everyone else. And also, you spend hours of thrifting and you find nothing. So, everything will be linked down below. Make sure you guys check it out. Smash the thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Make sure you guys check out yesterday's for 100 Lamborghinis. It's absolutely insane. So, make sure you guys go check that out. I'll see you guys tomorrow. And don't forget, guys, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it, guys.